Hello everyone and welcome to the next in our series of Daily Origami for YouTube. Today we're going to continue um, with some of the easier origami that is fun to work with with beginners. And I thought today what we could do is make a fish. And this kind of a fish is kind of a fun one to use because you can um, put a little paper clip on it and go fishing with a magnet if you want. It can be a really fun project to do with kids. So for this origami you just need one piece of origami paper. And uh, what we want to do is start off with some basic creases in our paper, just our horizontal and vertical creases in our paper. And then I'm going to go ahead and turn it over and do my diagonal creases as well. And we're going to be um, doing these creases to help us with the next fold, which is called a water bomb base. Um, if you've got all these creases in, what you can do then is looking at the top with it like a square, if you just let those creases naturally go, you find getting to a point where there's a triangle in the middle. We can just smooth all that out then. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take one of these flaps and fold it up to the top and do the same thing on the other side. so that you have something that looks like this. And I'm going to take the sides and I'm going to fold these into the center. And I want to try to get a good angle so that this crease is parallel with the center line there. I'll do the same thing over here. So you get something like so. Now these top little creases here, I'm going to tuck into these pockets that I have from that fold I just made. So if you just kind of open that up and slip this in as far as you can and then just smush it down to make a nice crease there like so. And do the same thing on this side. So I'll just open up that pocket a little bit. Just stick this in. So that you get something that looks like this. Then I'm going to go ahead and turn it over and what I want to do now is I'm going to fold down this flap like so and do the same thing on the other side as well. So I get something like this. And then I'm going to take this flap and I'm going to fold it out. And I want to fold it out at an angle so that it comes up a little bit higher than halfway here on the top and it's not all the way to this edge so just a little bit here to kind of create a little fin if you will. Once you've got that angled up I'm going to take both of these sides and bring them together so that I get this nice little part here that looks like a fin of a fish. Once you get this uh, kind of standing up like a fin here the next thing we want to do is we want to open up all this area here to kind of poof it out into a three dimension if we can. And the easiest way to do that is to use a pen and you'll notice this little section back here where there's a pocket. And I'm just going to go in there and I'm going to slowly smoosh it along. I want this bottom part to be the base here so I'm just going to keep working along till I can open it up a little bit. And I'll do the same thing on this side too. Poofing out those sides as much as I can. And you should be able to get to both sides from either hole actually so that'll help you kind of smooth it out until you can get a more three-dimensional looking kind of little fish and that is then the finished part there and then you could just put a little paper clip here on the fin and then you can uh, use that for a project if you want to do fishing with a magnet um, but these also make cute little decorations so that is our completed project for today a little fish Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.